as women, um, we're taught from a very young age that nighttime is a dangerous time for us. Don't walk alone at night. Make sure you have your keys between your fingers. So we're taught like all of these things that we constantly have to be doing to avoid sexual assault. Taking back the night literally means that we are reclaiming that for ourselves and saying that um, as women, we shouldn't have to feel like we're in danger. I'm Hannah Millette. I'm president of Students Advocating Gender Equality. My name is Marie Reimers. Um, I am the founder of SAGE, and then this year I was one of the co-coordinators of Take Back the Night. Where are you going? Why are you going there? Why are you dressed that way? You know, what right do you have to be here? This is explicitly what Take Back the Night is challenging. Today we're having our photo project in the Down Under, and that is where people can come write on a whiteboard and show why they support survivors, um, and then have their picture taken, and we're going to post those on our Facebook page. And then tomorrow we're showing uh, the film Telling Amy's Story, which is actually about domestic violence. On Thursday is our actual Take Back the Night event where we'll have a speaker and then we'll have a march towards the downtown library and then the speak out will be held there. Last year the event was organized by SAPA and they sort of handed it over to us this year and Marie and I both took it on as not only a SAGE project but as our uh, senior capstone women's studies project. I think like specific to college campuses, uh, sexual assault is a huge issue. Um, we know that one in four college women will be assaulted during their college careers, um, and that's a hugely outrageous number. Instead of expecting women to explain their presence and justify their presence in the public sphere, we should say that women shouldn't have to expect to be raped when they're in the public sphere, that women shouldn't have to make that justification. A lot of times, working with sexual assault issues, you constantly feel like you're losing, like you're not doing enough because it's still happening. But events like Take Back the Night empower you and give you more hope.